We are here at 1509 West, 450 South in Syracuse, Utah. This is a five bedroom, three and a half bath home with a three car garage, an additional RV pad that goes back behind the fence, a fully finished basement, fenced yard. Um, you can see it's got nice zero scaping um, for the landscaping. Um, nice big patio and pergola, which we'll take a look at um, when we go out back, but located in a nice uh, residential neighborhood. Um, it's an HOA neighborhood, so there is a HOA community pool as well. But uh, let's go take a look inside. You can see we come up onto a nice covered porch area. Nice tall entry door. Then you can see we come into this entryway. You've got access to the main living area, the stairway to the second floor and basement. You can see the nice entryway. Really nice modern colors, neutral um, color palette. This is kind of a formal living room or office that you could use. Looks out over the front porch and front yard. And then you come into this nice big great room, which is your living room. Really good size and you've got these nice big windows that overlook your backyard. You can just see how that living space kind of flows all together right into the, the dining area, which is right next to the kitchen. You can see you've got a sliding glass door again that overlooks the back door. You've got nice, um, Quartz countertops, white cabinets, stainless steel appliances. Got this nice breakfast bar here. Gas range. Your dishwasher is over there. Then you can see you've got a nice big pantry for additional storage right off the, the kitchen. You can see how that looks from this way as well. And then here you've got um, a little mudroom area with access to the two, or excuse me, the three car garage. Then you've got a coat closet, a little bench to take off your shoes. And then we do have right through here, you've got a half bath, which is nice for guests. They can just stay right on the main level. And while, we, while we're here, we'll take a look at the backyard. Really nice outdoor space at the property. So you can see you've got this huge cement patio. You've got a, a nice little shade pergola over here. Then again, you can see that zero scaping kind of continued here. We've got a, a trampoline and trampoline pit there. This um, over here is kind of the soft rubber mulch. And then you can see that RV pad. Um, that comes back behind the fence and then over here this is kind of cool as well got some got a little nice little row of garden boxes so if you like to grow herbs or vegetables got those um, but we'll go take a look at the rest of the interior We'll go upstairs. So we've got three bedrooms and two bathrooms upstairs. Nice, another big window. Plenty of natural light in this home. But uh, we've got the master suite up on this level as well. So you can see kind of how all that looks. This is one of my favorite master suites. Nice big bedroom. You've got window that overlooks the backyard. Got the two smaller picture windows. Then you've got this nice long master bath with a high vanity, dual sinks, nice big mirror. And you've got your separate shower 
a nice deep garden or soaker tub. And it just keeps going. And you've got your, you know, private restroom area. And then all the way at the back here, you've got this nice big master closet with windows. You even have a an additional linen closet in here for your, you know, towels and sheets. But yeah, really nice master suite with that uh, nice big bathroom and walk-in closet. And then we'll head straight across the call the hall, excuse me, and we've got another bedroom. And you've got the same neutral color palettes throughout the, the home. You've got roller shades on the on most of the windows. And then this bedroom too has a nice walk-in closet with a window. Then you've got your shared hallway bathroom. Tub and shower combination. And then we've got the laundry room with washer and dryer hookups. It's got an electric dryer hookup. Shelf, and you've got a little splash of color on the wall there, which is cool. And then we've got our third bedroom on this second floor. You can see, nice good sized closet. Then we're gonna head back down towards the um, basement. So in the basement, we've got a living area or family room, two more bedrooms, and another full bathroom. So to the left here, straight ahead, you've got a cold storage room, which is storage under the front porch. And then you've got a bedroom here. Come this way so you can see that. You've got the, this, the closet is larger because it's the closet under the stairs. You've got that fun little kind of playroom window there. And I'll peek in this closet so you can see that. So, nice big closet. And you've got that like little play area that wraps around under the stairs. Then we've got the living area down here. The door to the left there is just the utility room with furnace. You've got a nice um, fireplace, window, you can see a really good size um, family room. This here is just a like a bonus closet. You've also got a got a sink in here, so if you need to wash your hands or get a drink while you're down here enjoying the space, you're right there. And as we head back this way, we've got a full bathroom down here. And this is the fifth and final bedroom. And that concludes our video tour. So I'm gonna head back towards that front door so you can get a feel for the layout. But if you'd like to schedule a showing, you can do so right from our website at prorenterut.com. And you can see we'll come back up to the, the main living area and back to the front door. And thank you for taking our tour.